Human beings are made up of millions of cells. Inside every cell lies a nucleus which holds 46 chromosomes. Our chromosomes carry genes which make us into human beings. Our chromosomes are numbered from chromosome 1 to 22, with chromosome 1 being the largest chromosome and chromosome 22 being the smallest. The last pair of chromosomes are the sex chromosomes, with boys having an X and a Y and girls having two X chromosomes. Chromosomes have a top and a tail, known as the telomeres, and a centerpiece, which is known as the centromere. A paracentric inversion describes a situation where a chromosome has broken in two places. The intervening segment does not contain the centromere, and the segment has turned 180 degrees and reinserted itself upside down. Most people who carry paracentric inversions are healthy, Families and family members are identified with paracentric inversions because of investigations following a family history of recurrent miscarriage, infertility. In order to become a parent, you need to make a mature egg or sperm. Each parent only hands on half their chromosomes into the egg or sperm. Normally, each pair of chromosomes come together, exchange genetic material, known as crossing over, and divide. Problems can arise for paracentric conversion carriers during pairing up, as there is a segment of the chromosome upside down. When a paracentric conversion is present, a loop has to form in one of the chromosomes, so that the alike chromosomal segments and the genes that lie within are all aligned correctly. If a crossover occurs within the loop, two chromosomal segments are produced that are very unbalanced. One with two centromeres and the other alternative is a chromosome with no centromere. If a baby is conceived with either of these two chromosome products, the baby will miscarry. If crossing over occurs outside the loop, then the chromosomal products will be balanced and the baby will be healthy.